Hello. Hi, Miss Walsh. Uh, yes. First, ma'am, I, I understand your frustration. <laughs> Walsh. Uh, yes. First, ma'am, I, I understand your frustration. Uh, I didn't mean to lose the connection before. And I do apologize for calling so late at night, ma'am. The only reason that we called is we received a phone call from one of your family members, and they said that it was okay to go ahead and give you a call this time of night, ma'am. I was, by, my goodness, we would have never done it, and I do apologize. Praise Jesus. What family member? What's that, ma'am? What's the family member's name? Uh, ma'am, I believe her name was Lois. Well, I think this horse that called She's deceased. Lois Well, ma'am, maybe that was just because she thought maybe you were having some problems with that. Uh, let me let me look up the, the name of the family member here, ma'am. Just one second. Okay. Uh, do you know a Margaret or a Marg, ma'am? Uh, perhaps. Yeah, I, 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 I do see Marg here. Yeah, yeah perhaps. That, that may have been the family member that called in here. Okay. Now, ma'am, now what we do here is uh, we were just wondering if there's anything in your life that perhaps you needed help with, that maybe Jesus could help you with, or maybe we just needed to pray together. Okay. So, ma'am... Uh, is there anything in your life that's bothering you right now? Is everybody in the family well, I hope? As far as I know, yes. Oh, that's wonderful, ma'am. God bless you. God bless your family, ma'am. Mm hmm Oh, and where do you live, ma'am? I live in Trenton. Trenton, Tr Trenton, New Jersey. I, I, I had a friend from Trenton, New Jersey. No, Trenton, Ontario. In Canada. Canada. Oh my yeah. goodness, you sure is far away, man. My goodness. Yeah, Trenton, Ontario, Canada. So, so are you a Christian woman? Uh, I believe in God my way. Your way? Yeah. Oh, I see. Well, you know what? Everybody does share in their beliefs in a different way. Yes. Yes. So, uh, do you go to church often, Mrs. Walsh? No, I don't. I have the Bible. In my home, and I read it. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. You know, and God does see that. Yes. Uh, what's your favorite quote from the Bible? Do you have one that inspired you? Uh, not right off hand, no. Oh, that's okay. You know what? I've read the Bible so many times, too, it's almost at the point where it's gibberish. Mm -hmm. All right, and you have a family, is that correct, Mrs.? Have a couple girls. I got two daughters. Yes. Oh, that's wonderful. What's their names? One's name. My one daughter's name is Kathleen, and my other daughter is Jennifer. Oh, that's great. And and did they got any babies themselves? Uh, babies. Yeah, I got two uh, grandchildren. Oh, that's wonderful. What ages are they? One's uh, nine. The other one's two and a half. Oh my goodness. I think it's so interesting. When do parents ever stop counting in half months? Two and a half. Mm -hmm. I mean, do they get six year old? Do they say, you know what? He's six now. He can't be six and a half no more. That's right. That is interesting. Mm -hmm. I tell you though, you know, family's a good thing to have, you know. You want to keep yeah. close to your family and, and Jesus, and you got to read your Bible often, ma'am. Yeah. Now, seeing how you don't go into church, do you ever get a preacher out to your house? A what? A preacher. No. A father of God. No. No. Well, see, here at the Friends and Families of Jesus Network, uh, we can set that up for a preacher to come to your home, perhaps next weekend or during the week when you're not so busy. Or maybe to one of your children. Is is there one of your children perhaps that could 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 use the hand of Jesus? Well, they believe in Jesus their, their way. They believe in God their way. They truly believe in God. Oh, that's wonderful. But what I'm saying though, ma'am, is you know, is, is there any of them that are in need to maybe speak with the preacher? 
Praise uh, Jesus. Not that I know of. Oh, well, that's good. You got a good family that's nice and stable. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm, that's wonderful. So is it cold up there this time of year? Yeah. Oh, that, that's fantastic. I like cold that's, weather. See, down I, here... Uh, my brother-in-law goes to church every Sunday. Oh, he does? Yeah. Oh, he's a good Christian man. Salvation Army. Oh, the Salvation Army Church. Yeah. Oh my goodness. So, so are, 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 do you have a man in your life, a husband or a loved one? Yeah, I have a loved one in my life, but he's not with me, though. Oh, he's not with you no more, is he? Well, he's uh, around, yes. Oh, really? Okay. Well, that, that that's wonderful to hear. I'm glad that you have somebody in your life. I have. Oh, that is wonderful. And what's his name? Oh, wonderful. That is interesting. So, you know, what I recommend is that when you go to bed, you make sure to say your prayers at night. I do. Oh, that's Every wonderful. Night. All right. And make sure that your daughters say their prayers, too. You know why? Because Jesus looks out for everyone. Well, that's wonderful. Well, you know what, ma'am? We're going to let you go. We won't go ahead and send a preacher out to your home right away. No. But, you know... Well, with God's will, maybe you'll get one someday that'll come out yeah. to you.